the ball very well and I don't think he'll mind being targeted, but he'd be disappointed that's out there, I would have thought. Certainly a big treat watching his batting performance, but we certainly saw some big catches today as well. Ground fielding, the catching right across his tournament, exceptional. Now we're going to look at innovative batting as well. It's something you're really big, big on, the Sydney Thunder. Yeah, well, such composure that, um, yeah, great entertainment, great skill to be executed in this format. We've talked a little bit, a fair bit really, about Sydney Thunder and the need for the youngsters to really step up. Jason Flores, a decent knock from him. Extremely disappointed. But they were my bolters for this tournament. At, at pre-tournament, I suggested watch this team. I, think they'd re I thought they'd recruited well. I believe they have. But they just haven't got over the line. They've threatened. Hang in there with them. They've got, but they've got to win four on the hop now. Yeah, and been thoroughly entertaining on the way yep. as well. Yep, that's right. OK, time for a very quick break. They do. They flocked in tonight. Yeah, that record is amazing. And it isn't any wonder we look out the back at the moment and there's uh, Perth Scorchers players spread all around the boundary still signing autographs for the children. You know, it's 20 minutes after the game's finished. They're out there. They'll be there for a good half an hour, just creating that extra experience, that value add. So those youngsters, they'll be dragging their parents along next time. And uh, I think on the 7th, in four days' time, they take on the Hobart Hurricanes here. And the atmosphere, once again, will be electric. Yeah, the kids absolutely loving it this evening. Let's check in on our KFC Million Dollar Six celebrity now, AFL legend Glenn Jakovic with Katie Price. Three, a couple of nights ago, and they were already talking about this big clash, the big derby down there in Melbourne. And they know that if they get one more win, they're pretty much through into the semis, but they really they want to make sure they maintain that dominance that they started in the opening match of this season. It's a lot of fun at Etihad Stadium. 20,000 tickets already pre-sold, so uh, it is recommended that you go to the website and get your tickets early to avoid any queuing issues on the day out. Now let's check in on our Z-Box poll question. We Just, as I say, the moment of the game, that changed it around, yes, for me. Can you tell us how hard that is to do? Well, I've never done it without gloves. Yeah, um, exactly. It was difficult with gloves, so mm. to catch up to the ball like that and just get that left hand, not his favourite hand, that was brilliant. Good stuff, a big win for the Scorchers. Looking forward to the Melbourne Derby tomorrow. See you for that one, Gilly, and thank you for your company. We'll see you next time.